Hey guys, I'm going to make a quick video here on how to mine Coinier coins. If you're new to cryptocurrency, you've heard about it, you want to get involved with it, um, this is a new coin, it's pretty hilarious, uh, but this is how you get started. Um, go to Coinier coin, it's uh, actually Coinierco.in. <laughs> go to this website, you need to get yourself a wallet. That's the first thing you need to do. You just click this link here. Um, I think it's actually fixed. There was an error in the uh, first one they made, but I think this one took care of it. But go ahead and download that, um, extract it, and you should get a folder like this. And once you do that, just double click that, it'll open it up here. And now you have a wallet installed on your computer. Once you get that, um, we want to basically sign up for a mining pool. This is basically where your miner is going to go to solve these blocks and get yourself some Koine coins. Um, I use unitedminers.com. It's koye.unitedminers.com. Um, really, you can pick any one of these. This is just the one I happened to click on uh, when this first came out. So once you do that, you want to register for an account here. Um, usually there's a link down here that says like sign up or something like that. Just go ahead and sign up. Get yourself uh, an account. And uh, just, you know, just to be on the safe side, I'd use a password that you don't use for anything else, you know, for all this kind of stuff. Just so, uh, you know, if anything were to happen, you don't have to worry about it. Um, once you get signed up here, uh, what you need to do is go to Edit Account. And that'll basically bring up the uh, area where you want to put in your payment address. Now, if you go to your wallet, you can go to receive coins and there should be one there by default you can add different ones um, but basically you want to go there I made mine called United Miners that way you know when the uh, money comes in it, you can see where it's coming from that way if you want to take a payment or you know or whatever you'll know the source so you want to go ahead there just right click it copy the address put it in for payment address and then enter in the pin you used when you uh, signed up hit update account um, now this pool knows where to send your coins the next thing you need to do you need to go to my workers and basically you just make a uh, make a worker name so whatever you want it doesn't really matter um, it's just an, another way to track which computer you're running this on um, feel free to use mine if you want uh, it'll just go to my wallet but uh, you can go ahead and basically type in whatever you want here uh, make a password for it again don't don't use any passwords that you actually use you can see mine are kinda of ridiculous but it really doesn't matter um, so once you get that set up you gotta get yourself uh, an actual mining client um, I use BFG Miner and that website's here it's bfgminer.org uh, I'm using a Radeon video card, so this is good for that. If you have like a NVIDIA video card, you want to use uh, CUDA Miner, but for this tutorial, I'm going to use this. So, you know, go ahead and download the client. You know, once you do that, extract it. Now, this part is where people fall off. They kind of lose, uh, you know, interest because they're looking at this. They're like, what the hell? Um, what you need to do is just right click in here make a new text file you can call it whatever you want it doesn't really matter just open it up and I actually have this already done but I don't know why I just did that <laughs> but uh... let's see this is basically the uh, line of code you need to put in it's uh... I'll, I'll copy it down there and put it in the comments but BFG minor dash dash script dash o you can just copy and paste this but this is basically the way that it's connecting to that pool it basically connects your miner to that pool this is the address um, then you have your username for your worker password for your worker and then this is the intensity now I, I run this 24 hours a day on my regular computer at home and uh, I can actually use it and actually watch videos and movies and work and do stuff um, this basically goes from 1 to 20 
I keep it on 10 and uh, I'm still able to function on the computer. Like if you're going to go to sleep or something, you can just reopen it and set this higher if you want to. I haven't really noticed a huge difference. I mean, this isn't really a mining computer, but I keep it on this. Um, this really is the only line you need. I had to add this in there for mine to work for some reason. But basically, file, save as, and you just save it as a uh, .bat file. Whoa. So then you save that, and once you do that, you just double click that bat file. Now this this is the actual miner. Um, now you just basically need to follow the uh, instructions here. Press M, hit plus. I just type in auto. Now it just found my video card. And then just hit enter again. Now you're mining. <laughs> So hopefully these things end up turning out to be worth something. Like right now it's not really worth mining any Bitcoin just because basically your electricity used to uh, mine it is actually more expensive than uh, any kind of coin you'd actually get. But let's see. And that's it.